one Acer laptop the model on this one is I can show it to you is the Travelmate P256 series um, with a busted screen so uh, tools which will be required for this one which I believe I'm not took particularly took one of these apart before which would be a prising tool to remove the bevels edge and a small posi die screwdriver so let's just get to it so I'm going to start on the one side first just prising it apart wherever any corner you want to choose nice and gently and just gently chip it apart. Okay. No rush. Just gently use the tool. I'm just holding the bevel around the edge just gently with my fingers just keep the pressure on okay and around the corner down the bottom okay. not very good with my left hand but just for the video no definitely not very good with my left hand you'll have to excuse me a second Okay, I'm just going to slide my fingers just down the front of the screen gently. There's no pressure to do, you know, there's no... I'm going to turn that off to be honest with you. Yep. So I'm going to pull the screen right back and just gently ease the bevel off the front. And there we go. Okay, just set that to one side. Okay, next, using the small posi screwdriver. Oh, that was quite simple. Okay. Three and number four. And hopefully this should be this should free the screen up now. Just be careful. Okay, and behind here there is a connector which is taped on. So you just gotta gently peel this tape back from the top. I don't know if you can see that. Let me just zoom in a little bit for that. Come back a little bit. Just want to zoom into that. Okay. Sorry about the uh, my arm's been in the way. Okay, and then that just pulls out like that. So that's the broken screen. So what I'm going to do, there's a plastic film on the front of this screen. I zoom back out again. Sorry about that. Oops. Okay. So I'm going to leave that on for now. I'm going to put the protective polythene over the top. Flick it back over and then reconnect that. But I might have to get a bit more tape, I think, because the glue is stuck on the other screen. So 
open, if you can see that. Okay, a little bit fiddly. So, it's just, I'm going to have to get some more tape for this as well. So, there, just push it in home like that. Don't put too much pressure on. Okay. And I'll need to get a bit more tape. I'm just going to put a bit of strong tape over that, so I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I'm going to use a little bit of duct tape to hold it down. So don't much on a bit. Sit it home nicely. Before we do anything, I'm going to switch back on, make sure the screen works, of course. And no, it doesn't. Yes, it does. I didn't give enough time. Okay, so we know that's working. And then we're going to do reverse now. Okay, making sure that you um, definitely push. But you can see that the connector. You make sure that pushes home securely. A little bit of tape. I mean, that would stay on there normally, but it's just probably got warm and overheated. Um, and also down here, you've got to make sure the wires are tucked in. There's little grooves where they fit, so just make sure they're tucked in properly. And then we can start fitting, we can start putting the screws back in. It's pretty straightforward. Okay, we need to over tighten. Protected. Just pulling the little tab. Okay, and then we're going to refit the bevel. So if you want to push the screen down just a bit further, so that the little protectors, hinge protectors, fit over, and then just. At the bottom of the screen here, what you want to do, if you want to make sure that fits home properly, is put your hand behind, because you don't want to damage the screen. Okay, so you're holding the base of the screen, because you could crack the screen again, okay? So, you'll see it all clip in nicely. But if you check the edges afterwards, and it should be fitting beautifully. Close the lid, and yeah, that's fine. And then we'll give it another test. And that's about it, I think. We'll just see what happens now. Yep, that's working great. Okay, thank you very much. Hope this is some help. Goodbye.